So if you want to make six figures, you can't just be talking about you want to make six figures. You hear what I'm saying to you tonight? If you do the three things I tell you to do tonight, I guarantee you, whatever it is you want to do in life, you'll be able to do. Guru said, if you want to make money, I'll meet you tomorrow, 4 a.m. So the young man got there at 4 a.m. He all ready to rock and roll, got on the suit, should have worn shorts. The old man grabs his hand and said, how bad do you want to be successful? He said, real bad. He said, walk on out in the water. So he walks out into the water. Watch this. When he walks out into the water, it goes waist deep. So he's like, this guy crazy. Adrian, he's like, I want to make money. He got me out here swimming. I didn't ask to be a lifeguard. I want to make money. He got me in. So he said, come out a little further. Walked out a little further. Then he had it right around this area. The shoulder area. So this old man crazy. He's making money, but he's crazy. He said, come on out a little further. Came out a little further. It was right at his mouth. My man, like, I'm about to go back in here. This guy is mine. So the old man said, I thought you said you wanted to be successful. He said, I do. He said, walk a little further. He came, dropped his head in, held him down, holding him down. My man getting scratching, holding him down. Just before my man was about to pass out, he raised him up. He said, I got a question for you. Somebody answered the question for me. He said, when you were underwater, what did you want to do? Lee, I'm looking for a different word, though. Than lip. What's that word? He said, I wanted to breathe. He told the guy, he said, when you want to succeed as bad as you want to breathe, then you'll be successful. That's it. And when you get to the point where all you want to do is be successful as bad as you want to breathe, then you'll be successful. And I'm here to tell you, number one, that most of you say you want to be successful, but you don't want it bad. You just kind of want it. You don't want it badder than you want to party. You don't want it as much as you want to be cool. You, most of you don't want success as much as you want to sleep. Some of you love sleep more than you love success. And I'm here to tell you today, if you're going to be successful, you've got to be willing to give up sleep. You've got to be willing to work off for three hours of sleep, two hours. If you really want to be successful, someday you will have to stay up three days in a row. Because if you go to sleep, you might miss the opportunity to be successful. That's how bad you got to want it. You got to go days without, listen to me, you got to want to be successful so bad that you forget to eat. It's not about where you come from. It's about heart. You come to a place where, you know, being smart ain't enough. You got to have heart. That's number one. Watch number two. To be able at any moment to sacrifice what you are for what you will become. That's the number two thing. To what? Listen to me. Pain is temporary. It may last for a minute, or an hour, or a day, or even a year. But eventually, it will subside. And something else will take its place. If I quit, however, it will last forever. He told the guy, he said, when you want to succeed, as bad as you want to breathe, then you'll be successful.